good. One Piece update. We are finally at the end of Alabasta. Okay? I've done it. I've done it. Me and the crew. Okay? Me, Zoro. Okay? Luffy. We, we did it. Fucking Princess Vivi sucks. Okay? But we did it. We fucking did it. It's raining. You know, I brought the rains down in Africa. You know what I'm saying? Like, shit's crazy. Um, it, Crocodile was a great... Crocodile was a great villain. I blessed the rains down in Africa. Okay? I, I, I blessed the rains down in Alabasta. Okay? Nico Robin is so sick. So hot. Oh, my God. Okay? Holy shit. Literally, stop. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me, Nico. Nico Robin. Stop playing with my heart. Stop tugging at my heartstrings. I mean, this motherfucker, dude. The One Piece author. Listen, all memes aside, like, everyone's bodacious, okay? Literally, there's, like, one lady who's, like, fat who then unironically becomes, like, super sexy. Like, that's her arc. Like, every woman is drawn the exact same way. But, like, character-wise, like, character-wise, they're so good. Like, the, in a weird way, it, it sometimes passes the Bechdel test, okay? While simultaneously having, like, the absolute worst way to draw women. I don't know how to describe it. Like... These are well-written characters. They have well-crafted backstories. Like, these women aren't there just to be, like, sex objects. But they're certainly drawn in a way that they are sex objects. You know what I mean? It, it's just, it's very, very interesting. Like, it, it is very interesting that, like, they all literally look the same with, like, very minor tweaks to their hair. But, but... When you look past their appearances, they all have incredibly unique backstories. They're powerful figures. They're not like, they're not there to be, uh, you know, a damsel in need of, uh, in need of being saved. So did Hassan watch a weird anime? Yeah. The weirdest. Their breasts grow in size throughout the series too. Oh dude, Nami. Nami's titties literally grew like eight sizes through the first multiple arcs. Like, it's crazy. And then, like, and then weird enough, weirdly enough, like, here's the other thing, okay? Uh, yeah, Nami's, na Nami's, Nami's boobs are, are, are like eight times larger uh, by the end of the fucking, you know, third arc or whatever. It's weird. But then also on top of that, she will literally be like, she will literally be like, oh, man, I bought these outfits for us in Alabasta for us to wear. And then the other character, Vivi, will be like, yo, that's like a dancer's dress. Like, you're not supposed to wear that in the desert. And she's like, why not? And, and it's like so obvious. It's like naming fucking Quiet, the sniper, Quiet. You know what I mean? Like, that's deliberate. That's a deliberate uh, sexist thing that uh, Hideo Kojima did, right? Like, Women should be seen and not heard type beat, right? It's like, no, we're doing fan service and we're letting you know we're doing fan service. It's basically like that. Um, you'll be ashamed of your words and deeds. Wait, why? I love when people still act like, like, I love Hideo Kojima, okay? I love Metal Gear Solid. But it is funny when, when I mention that, when I mention the quiet thing, they go, oh, it's a she's a sniper she's supposed to not talk okay bro i know i i know is the kajimbo take i mean not that yeah i mean hey speaking of snipers who talks non-stop usopp my least favorite character still annoying don't care <laughs> this is so funny continued but once you recognize the secret reason for her exposure, you will feel ashamed for your words and deeds. <laughs> you will be ashamed for your words and deeds. <laughs> What's your damage with Vivi? Uh, normally, princesses are always damsels in distress, okay? 
And Vivi definitely fits that category, even though she can take matters into her own hands. But because she can take matters into her own hands and she's supposed to be a part of like an excellent team of assassin, uh, you know, bounty hunters, I expect more from her and not fucking fall 11 times while, uh, you know, in a running sequence for three and a half minutes, which makes up the bulk of the episode. Okay. Like, oh no, I fell again. Oh no, I fell again. It's like, dude. Get better shoes, Vivi. What the fuck are you doing? I mean, seriously, stop. It's like, how many times do you fall in one fucking episode? Your knees are busted, dog. Your knees are bloody, okay? Why? Why are you like this? The Alabasta credit music is goaded. Alabasta's final sequence is scored like a masterpiece, dude. It has no business being that fucking epic, okay? Like the last... Sergio Tacchini, thank you for the 20 gifted subs, uh, my friend. Tried Chainsaw Man? Um, yeah, I did. Um, and then I stopped because I was like, I don't want to fucking, I don't want to, uh, I, I don't want to wait every week for 20 minutes of content. So I stopped. So I'm just like going to fucking one shot it. You know what I mean? I, I think One Piece is like ruined me. Um, and I'm watching Andor as well, but uh, I haven't been, like, paying super close attention to Andor. Like, I, I just, like, kind of have it on as background. Average anime watcher experience, to be honest. Yeah, I don't want to do that. <laughs>